marsh fishing in the winter in Louisiana you either get fog or you get wind so today we got a lot of fog and overcast but we got a lot of wind too so we'll see how today goes my first bite what we got here what we got here we're we gonna make it we're gonna be close I think it's a nice tail let's see what we got I heard fish popping and away we go, oh, about 12 and a half, almost 13. One in the box, beautiful. Let's see if we can find some more. It took a while. I kept hearing them pop over here. As you can see, the forecast is a lot stronger than the wind predicted. Well, that's nice to have that in the box because I've been fighting skunks. I got skunked from the bank a week ago and I got skunked in the river with cut bait. Three hours bank fishing in the river. A lot of bite, so got the skunk off. I had a two good one. Oh, yes. Oh well, that's a good one there. Do the over the shoulder into the box move. See if we can double up. And then right when the bite starts, we got boats coming out the harbor. Oh yes, that's an even better one. Tighten up the drag a little. Come on, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, they swallowed it down, too. Come on. Come on, let me have my bait back. Come on, you're going to mess me up. Right when the bite gets good, you're going to mess me up. Yeah, I got it in my thumb. Look. Oh, shit. He broke the tail off my bait. Damn it. But you know what? I got two poles rigged for when the action's like this. See if we can keep them going here. Can we triple up? Yes, we can. So they're in shallow. I've been out in the deep water all morning trying to find them up here on this flat. That's a nice one. They're all nice when they go in the box, so. See my new death chest? It's hard to open. Got it. All right, can we go four in a row? I'm gonna have to move that rod in a second. Better one. Even better. Oh, he might be too small. He might not make the cut. Let's see, let's let's put a measure on you. Let's put a measure on you. Oh, uh, he's about eleven and a half. Just like I figured, let me get this rod out my way. Crazy five. There we go. There we go. That feels like a good one too. Oh, he's all tangled in the bow. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Open up. Don't press my tail off. Come on. I 
ice chests. It's terrible for that. I said a minute ago I've been fighting a bad skunk. I think I got it off my back. I think I got rid of the skunk. I just need to catch a few more. done hook today for some reason. I guess that means I'm getting a good hook set. Put this knife in my boat just for this just for this occasion catch a giant oyster out here fishing Look at the size of that oyster breakfast of champions mm -hmm. That's good. <laughs> Nothing like a nice salty oyster while you're fishing. Keep her in the box. He'll go in the box. Yes, sir. Nice fish. Come on, let go. Let go. Go, no, come on. Got a foggy all morning this morning. Crazy weather today. It's supposed to have been a lot calmer. It's supposed to really blow this evening. Go to He's gonna be close. He's gonna be close. And he swallowed it down, of course, but might be able to get it out. Yeah. Oh, he's over 12, which is a good thing because he was messed up. Fishing in the fog. Got a nice speck bite this morning at daylight, but it didn't last long. This is a shame. Nice fish. I think I got 10, maybe 12. All right, today's death chest count. 10 specks in a death chest. 10 nice specks. I sure needed a day like this after them skunks. 
Well, I was able to get out and make a trip this morning. I ended up with 10 specks in a death chest. I needed a good trip after the last two skunks. I got skunk bait fishing a little over a week ago, and then I went cat fishing in the Mississippi River. Stayed three hours with cut bait and shrimp and not a bite. So, got the skunk off. Fishing on a foggy morning. I'm leaving now. The fog's just now burning off, but the wind's picking up. That's why, that's why the fog's burning off. So 10 specks in the death chest. Till the next video, get out there and go fishing.